TPG Reader Paul is about to cancel his Sapphire Preferred card. Any recommendation where to transfer and store my Ultimate Rewards points? Well, he brings up a very good point. If you have a Ultimate Rewards card uh, or American Express Membership Rewards card and then you cancel the card, you will lose your points. So it's critical that you transfer them to a partner or use them uh, with pay with points uh, before you cancel your card. However, I really wouldn't recommend just uh, transferring them out um, you know, you really lose value and you lose flexibility when you um, transfer in advance. But I would say in general, United and Hyatt, uh, British Airways is also a really good partner if you know how to use British Airways miles. Um, so it really depends what you need, but between, actually Singapore Airlines, if you want to fly Singapore, uh, there are some really great deals there. Um, so between those four, those are probably the, the transfer partners that I use the most. But what I would recommend is instead sign up for a card like the Chase Inc. Plus card. Uh, there's no fee the first year and you'll keep your points active and get 50,000 extra points when you spend 5,000 within three months. Even if you don't want to get a card with an annual fee, the Chase Freedom card will also keep your points active. There's no annual fee. There's great five point per dollar rotating categories and then down the line you can get another card that unlocks those points to transfer to partners. So uh, instead of closing out of Ultimate Rewards altogether, they're among the most valuable points out there. I would still recommend keeping a relationship with Chase and, uh, and a UR card open uh, just so you can keep your points in that central pool and then use them as needed. So any other questions, tweet me at the points guy and make sure you like us on Facebook.